forever haunted. Backstory About 10 to 12 years ago, I, 10 15 F now 23, and a few friends went to an old abandoned watermill where lots of deaths happened. Being a young, dumb kid, we played with a Ouija board. Well, as expected, it moved, creepy things happened, and we all ran for our lives. I was the only one that didn't go back and didn't say goodbye to the board. I definitely opened a portal that will forever stay with me. Fast forward to the present, a lot of unexplained things happened over the years, but recently have been getting bad. One that will always stick with me was when my poor dog got hurt. It started when I was hanging out in my living room watching TV. My dog was in her cage, bed rest from oral surgery, in my room. I heard loud bangs on my wall that was shared with the living room. I originally thought it was my dog shifting in her cage and just happened to move the cage against the wall. Then I heard a loud crash and my dog yelping. I ran into my room to find my light had blown and shattered all over my floor and my drugged up dog shaking with all her fur up in her cage. I got her out and put her in the living room in a makeshift cushion for while I cleaned up the glass. After I checked up on her in the living room and light knocks were coming from my room on the wall shared with my living room. My dog's tail was broken at the base, I brought her to the vet first thing in the morning, and she refused to step foot back in my room. After I got so mad that something hurt my dog I yelled to whatever or whoever it was that if it touched my dog again I'll make sure to send it right back to where it came from and it's gonna have to go through me to get to her. I woke up to a huge bruise on my back the next morning and I got my house blessed by the church the same night. I now sage my house and myself weekly and a lot of the unexplained things calm down a lot. Every once in a while I'll hear my name being called or loud bangs on my front door but ignore it.